everyone, Mookie here. Um, I was asked to speak to you guys about how to connect with God through worship. And I thought I would start with Psalm 105 verse 1 to 4, which says, Give praise to the Lord, proclaim his name, make known among the nations what he has done. Sing to him, sing praise to him, tell of all his wonderful acts, glory in his holy name. Let the hearts of those who seek the Lord rejoice. Look to the Lord and his strength, seek his face always. And we seek his face by through worship. That's one of the ways that we can do that, through stepping into his presence, through giving our full selves, our, our spirits, our souls, our whole beings, using our voices and our tongues to just praise his name because he deserves that glory. He deserves that worship. And I know there's so many distractions in the world today. There's so many things going on around us that can pull us away. But one of the things I found so key and so important in this time is worship. When I don't know what else to do, when I'm so confused and worried and heartbroken and angry and happy and joyous, I just want to praise God. And that can be a challenge sometimes because we feel like there's other things to do. But I can guarantee you that worshipping God brings us into alignment with his spirit. It refocuses us. It takes our, our distractedness away and brings us into alignment with the Father. That we can just be with him. He wants to be with us. He seeks our attention. He wants us to be present with him. And we can do that through worship. Whether it's listening to a song and just washing yourself in, 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 in worship. Singing a cappella, whatever it is. And don't be worried that you're, you might not sound the most amazing singer. You're not Mariah Carey. or It doesn't matter. God doesn't care about things like that. But I've always considered worship to be one of the only gifts that I can give to God. My worship is one of the only things I can give. It doesn't balance out what all the amazing and wonderful things and the sacrifice he made for me. But in knowing that it's something, a tiny slither of something I can give to him, I want to give my all. Pour my heart and soul into that. And let God know, let God know. <laughs> how much I love him, worship him, give, bring his name glory and lift his name above all things. And so I pray over you right now that over this 21 days, that you will be able to step into his presence and just worship him with your full selves. Unadulterated, without any expectations of yourself, that you just give everything that you are to the Father, that you will have a new and refreshed encounter with the Heavenly Father, you will see something so wonderful and so new through your voice, through the worship that you give him. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.